is up my original bagels and welcome to some Call of Duty Modern Warfare gameplay. So today guys I want to talk to you all about is season 3. So April 8th which is a Wednesday and it's probably going to be a midnight release of season 3 for Modern Warfare. So we actually got an image and it has a lot of things in this image. So the first thing we'll actually look at is the guy who's in the main shot of this image and the guy actually has a prosthetic leg and this actually kind of seems really cool because this is what actually happens in war and everything like that you know that's just anyway but moving on and this looks very like Alex from the campaign so for anyone who hasn't played the campaign Alex was a CIA agent that helped the rebels uh, basically take over the country or re take over the country to make it better and at the end he actually has to s sacrifice himself to blow up a factory now we actually didn't see him die but we did see the place blow up so more than likely he did survive and that's what they say in Hollywood as well if you didn't see the person die then he is technically still alive and this actually is confirms that he did survive so this means then that the campaign happened before the multiplayer does which is kind of weird in my mind but I think I might save that for another video also what is confirmed this even more is that the voice actor actually tweets out that he's back and that makes it a bit dumb because they're gonna have to have some kind of filler or a little background kind of thing like they did with Ghost when he came in season 2 to fill us in on what happened to Alex, how he's still alive and how he actually got his prosthetic leg. Of course we know because of the explosion and everything like that but if he's in the middle of it how did he actually survive that? That's the kind of thing that I want to see. Hopefully they do that, they should really do that. So the background on the right hand side you can actually see Backlot, which I actually made a video saying that this was going to be coming to Season 3 there a while back. And if we actually look at the left side of the image as well, we'll see a new map, which I think will be Village. Now, it won't be the exact same as Modern Warfare Trees Village. This one is going to be a new one, and I feel like they just took the same name probably to generate hype around it just to get people like oh this is gonna be village everyone love village oh this is gonna be unreal but i don't think it's village well it is going to be village it's going to be called village and everything like that it is 100 percent confirmed that it's going to be called village but it's not going to be the old village it will be a new village now when i say a new village i don't mean that they're going to kind of do what they did with raid in Black Ops 3 and I think they did it in Black Ops 4 as well where they kind of changed the surfaces to make them look more futuristic and then make it look all Roman and everything. They're not going to do that. This is going to be a complete from the ground up new map. Now if we look at the image again we'll actually see three operators. Alex and to his left or your left even you'll see a guy. Now this is meant to be called Ronan and the woman to the right we actually don't know who she is but if I was to make a guess I feel like this could be kind of Alex's group the way you have kind of the SAS how you have Captain Price and Ghost and all that and I feel like this could be something like Ghost's team where you had uh, Ghost, Talon and Mace I feel like it'd be something like that if that's the case then they could play a vital role of telling us how uh, Alex got out of the factory once it blew up where how he lost his leg and everything like that they could have been in another f firefight somewhere or something like that or they dragged him out or and had to amputate his leg because it was all rotten or something like that I don't really know but yeah this is the end of the video guys i hope you did like it if you did please hit the like button right beside that button there should be a subscribe button next to the subscribe button there is a notification bell and you can hit that to stay up to date whenever i upload or whenever i go live on this channel which is going to be rare speaking of live streams i have a twitch 
channel link to that will be in the description below once you're there you can hit the follow button and right beside that you can hit the notification bell i'll probably be going live this week because of the modern warfare weekend and i hope to anyway and i also have a twitter link to that will be in the description below as well and yeah as it guys hope you like favorite and subscribe and peace